guys welcome to my channel thanks for stopping by if you're new here today we're gonna talk about five things to know before starting um, career in supply chain um, so if you're in a life where you're considering to go um, into supply chain uh, watch this video till the end and I'll tell you my five things that I wish I knew when I um, start career in supply chain So the first thing is um, you want to consider is um, day in the life of uh, a person who works in supply chain um, is never the same. Every day there will be a different fires, unexpected events, um, requiring problem solving skills and strategic thinking to think 10 steps ahead and always have plan B. Um, also you will um, learn to deal with a lot of different aspects uh, like finance, accounting, planning, logistics, project management, engineering, and so on. And you, if you're not familiar with these areas, don't worry, you will learn eventually. Um, but if you um, have knowledge of any of those um, areas, it will help you to, be, um, to start your career and be on top of um, the game. Um, because supply chain touches a lot of um, multiple business areas um, like finance, logistics, manufacturing, if it's manufact you know if it's a business that manufactures something, um, and many more areas. Um, if you're planning to work in supply chain, um, it will require people skills. Um, it also helps you if you are a team player um, because most likely you will um, work cross-functionally with, um, and at times people that you will work with um, have no supply chain background. So you'll have to, um, you know, have a skills to explain um, supply chain topics for the teams that doesn't have that background. Um, and when you're just starting your career in supply chain, don't be afraid to ask a lot of questions, even at, if at times um, you think those questions are not very smart. Um, ask them anyway and you will be surprised um, how many, uh, you will be surprised how much more you will learn um, if, you know, if you would not ask those questions thinking, oh, those probably everybody knows except me. So don't be afraid to ask questions. Um, and um, um, and never stop learning. Um, supply chain constantly changing, constantly changing. Um, recent example is pandemic. It's totally different supply chain now with a lot of fires and force majeures and so on. Um, and keep improve um, and keeping an um, improvement mindset will help you a lot in the long run. So. Uh, be curious, be, um, you know, a lot of uh, about new software, about new um, ways of doing the same type of work and continue to improve and continue to learn new things. Um, and it will also help you in the long run. Um, last but not least, um, don't be afraid to um, take a risk. As I mentioned in the beginning, a day in the life of um, the supply chain team is never the same and it requires to deal with um, um, fires daily, with risks. Um, so sometimes you will have to make a decision and take a risk. Um, but if your thoughts are logical and if you are um, have arguments to support your decision, you will be okay. Uh, to summarize, um, a day in the life um, is never the same. Uh, you will have to deal with um, a lot of fires and uncertainties, um, with um, a lot of people uh, with different backgrounds and functions of the business, 
um, lots of learning, but it's rewarding because every day um, you'll make a decision that will save um, company money or keep important innovation um, on time. And if you like feeling accomplishments every day, I would strongly recommend um, you join the supply chain family. And thank you for sticking uh, with me till the end of the video. Um, if you already work in supply chain, um, comment below um, what you wish you would know before you started, um, before you started your career in supply chain. Um, and if you're in a life where you have to make decision and you're considering going into supply chain, hopefully this video helps you. Um, and I'm sure you will make uh, the right decision, but I'm just hoping I helped you um, just a little um, to guide you to the path. And that's all for this video. Again, thank you and we'll see you next time.